There is a little girl. Lizzie is her name. She has a pet wolf who is good and tame. They play like friends. It's just a game, but sometimes he goes mad. In a bleak remote town, there is a young girl named Lizzie Gale, but she is not your regular little girl. What could a nine-year-old be capable of? What happens when innocent two-year-old Toby is abducted? He pounces on Lizzie with a mighty roar and opens his jaw like a big trap door. And then she can see the lightning sliding down his throat. The stomach of the wolf is a big black pit and down she goes till she falls in it. It's dark and hot and it's full of shit. She cannot stay afloat. How can innocent child play turn into a suspicious homicide case against a girl that is almost too young to comprehend right from wrong? Lizzie thrashes all about. She cannot see and she cannot shout. She cannot breathe and she can't get out. Lizzie, Lizzie, Lizzie. When the little boy is found dead in an abandoned train yard, the community bands together to find closure to this unspeakable act of torture. I should buy you a naughty girl, or don't you make another peep? No one worse in all the world. Time to go to sleep. I don't know you anymore. Where's my girl? Lizzie, you know when you were little, you'd get angry, I'd say, go outside and bash up a tree? And one time you came in with all your fists all cut up. You said to me, Dad, help me. She could do it again. I don't know what goes on inside her head. How she sees things. I thought I did. I don't know anything anymore. I murder so that I may come back. She wrote it. She drew pictures. The shoes on the table. She took you to the place. No one knows you, no one cares, you're not in your mother's prayers. All you know is to lie, hush, hush a bye. How can I live with that? You can squash it down, but it's never going to go away. Watching her grow up, seeing her own kids and always knowing, but at what price? What would she have to do just to go from one day to the next? Either living like that or prison, it's, it's the end. Either one's gonna break her. Say hello from me, and from her dad. Has he been in to see her? Tell her we'll see her. Tell me I was right. Please just go away. Just leave us alone. A Christmas poem by Lizzie Gale. I looked out the window tonight. The moon and the stars were so bright. Then I heard a shout. Help, help, let me out. The voice was small, it came from the wall. It called to me further. You know you'll do murder if you don't let me out.